How much does a military drone cost? With the raging war in between Russia and Ukraine, military drones have yet again proved themselves to be a key factor to victory. These small but deadly devices can be used to scout areas and even blow up tanks. But these unmanned flying predators come at a price. And some of them are so expensive you probably would not want to crash it after the first flight. Today we will look at some of the most expensive military attack drones that are around today. And make sure to stick until the end, because the price tag on the last drone we have is truly unimaginable. And jokes on you, the one in the thumbnail is not even the most expensive one. But before we dive in, let us give you a breakdown of the types of military drones that are for a better understanding for their prices. Number 1. Micro Drones and Nano Drones These are super small insect sized drones that you often see in blockbuster movies. Despite being tiny in size, these drones are fully equipped with high-tech cameras for surveillance and can usually send image data back to their terminals digitally. One example is the Black Hornet, which is a 1 inch by 4 inch and costs about $195,000 per unit. Number 2 are small tactical drones. These are small, but not as small as micro drones and nano drones, and lightweight. They can be carried by soldiers in pockets to be tossed up into the air. An example is the Fulmar. It is able to fly for 12 hours at a max range of 90 kilometers. Another example is the Raven, which can cost more than $35,000 per unit. At number 3 we got medium sized reconnaissance drones. These drones are also commonly referred to as HALE or MALE drones which are acronyms for High Altitude, Long Endurance and Medium Altitude, Long Endurance, respectively. They are primarily used for ISTAR, intelligence surveillance, target acquisition and reconnaissance purposes. Heron is a type of drone. It is used by the US, Canada, Australia, Turkey, Morocco and India for reconnaissance use. One Heron and one ground station cost about $140 million. At the number 4 spot we got large surveillance and combat drones. These are more well known military drones and the US armed forces particularly. They are run by pilots on the ground through a satellite link up. These types of drones are usually armed and sent for extrajudicial killing missions. A popular example is the Global Hawk, which is operated over conflict zones and can fly at an altitude of up to 18,000 meters. The Global Hawk scans mobile phone calls for surveillance of signals rather than combat though. Interesting fact, the Global Hawk that almost waged war against Iran in 2019 costed $220 million. Reaper drones carry laser guided bombs and other types of air to surface missiles to serve the US armed forces. They can fly for over a thousand miles and operate non-stop for 14 hours. The UK, Netherlands, France and Spain air forces also use Reapers. A Reaper costs about $32 million per piece. Now that it is clear what types of military drones there are, let's dive in some of the most expensive ones around. Number 1. The INC-C2 Scan Eagle priced at $800,000 per unit. This is a small, low altitude but long endurance drone for reconnaissance. In addition, it helps the military with search and rescue, border control and battleground damage monitoring. Its wingspan is over 10 feet and flight life of more than 24 hours. You can expect it to fly up to 20,000 feet at a maximum of 92 miles per hour horizontally. At number 2 we got the Chengdu Pterodactyl 1, which costs $1 million per unit. This is a medium altitude but long endurance drone that also goes by the name Wing Lung. It is roughly 9 feet tall and 20 feet long, designed for imaging. Its wingspan is 40 feet, delivering a maximum of 16,500 feet in altitude and 180 miles per hour in speed. It can stay in the air for 20 hours and probably a little longer if you smash the subscribe button right now. At number 3 we got Kratos XQ58 Valkyrie, priced at $3 million per unit. This $3 million drone is designed as a force multiplier to serve as a loyal wingman for the F-22 Raptor or F-35 Lightning in combat missions. It is about 28 feet long and can impressively reach 700 miles per hour on a 2500 mile flight with a 22 foot wingspan. Number 4 we got the Aeronautics Defense Dominator XP, priced at $3.75 million per unit. This is a strategic multi-purpose medium altitude long endurance drone that is 26 feet long and has a wingspan of 44 feet. It can fly over 30,000 altitude feet and reach a maximum speed of 220 miles per hour. Number 5 we got the Boeing A160 Hummingbird, priced at $6 million per unit. 
The Boeing A160 Hummingbird is an unmanned aerial vehicle helicopter. Its design incorporates many new technology never before used in helicopters, allowing for greater endurance and altitude than any helicopter currently in operation. The A160 was to be deployed in Afghanistan with the Argus IS camera in June 2012. But just before deployment, the Army issued a stop work order to Boeing because the aircraft had a high probability of continued technical and scheduled delays and costs and risk had increased so significantly that program continuation was no longer in the best interest of the government. Number 6 we got the MQ-8 Fire Scout, priced at $15 million per unit. The Northrop Grumman MQ-8 Fire Scout is an unmanned autonomous helicopter developed by Northrop Grumman for use by the United States Armed Forces. The Fire Scout is designed to provide reconnaissance, situational awareness, aerial fire support and precision targeting support for ground, air and sea forces. In January 2006, an RQ-8 8 Fire Scout landed aboard the amphibious transport ship Nashville while it was steaming off the coast of Maryland near the Patuxent River. This marked the first time an unmanned helicopter has landed autonomously aboard a moving US Navy ship without a pilot controlling the aircraft. At number 7 we got the IAI Eaton around $35 million per unit. The IAI Eaton is unmanned reconnaissance aircraft developed in Israel in the early 21st century by the Mala Division of Israel Aerospace Industries. Aircraft is a newer version of the AIA Heron, a medium altitude long endurance UAV. The Eaton can operate at altitudes above commercial air traffic and features all weather capability, de icing systems, automatic takeoff and landing systems, and triple redundant avionics. It is a high wing cantilever monoplane with a wing of high aspect radio. Booms extend rearward from the wings and carry twin tails that are joined by a common horizontal stab stabilizer. The main units of the tricycle undercarriage retract into the tail booms and the nose wheel retracts into the fuselage. A single turboprop engine is mounted in the rear fuselage driving a pusher propeller. Construction throughout is of composite materials. Now let's take a look at the higher price range drones out there because yes. These just now were not even that expensive yet. Crazy, right? Number one, we got the MQ-25 Stingray, priced at $201 million per unit. This drone was awarded an 804 million contract in 2018 and is set to be operational by 2024. It is designed to carry some 15,000 pounds of fuel and reach a maximum range of 600 miles. Unless the Northrop Grumman X-47B debuts, it will be the world's first aerial refueling drone. Number 2 we got the BAE Systems Tyrannis, priced at $206 million per unit. This is a still developing drone that is expected to hit the air in 2030. It is designed to attain the max speed of 700 miles per hour, 50,000 feet flight ceiling, its wingspan is 33 feet and its length is 40 feet. Number 3 we got the Northrop Grumman X-47B, priced at $405 million per unit. This drone is made to assist the US Navy, but as of right now, is still a guinea pig prototype. It's the first autonomous aerial refuel with impressive specs, 62 foot wingspan and a max speed of 700 miles per hour. And at number 4 we got the RQ-4 Global Hawk, priced at $131 million per unit. This high altitude long endurance speed was built for the Air Force, equipped with a sensor suite that gives global weather, day and night intelligence and fulfills surveillance and reconnaissance purposes. This is a well known drone to the public costs a whopping $131 million. So what is the most expensive military drone? The price of a drone depends on the size, capability and range of the system. While none of them are cheap, unmanned aerial systems can be procured for a relatively low amount compared to manned aircraft. Of those listed by military machine, the most expensive military drone is the Northrop Grunman X-47B at roughly $405 million per unit. This drone is classified as an unmanned combat aircraft and is roughly the size of a strike fighter. The Grunman X-47B is the first drone to have autonomous aerial refueling capabilities, which is a contributing factor to its astronomical procurement price. While other unmanned systems may not have the same top-of-the-line tech and capabilities, they range and price from under 1 million to hundreds of millions. Now, are you armed with all the necessary information to answer how much does a military drone cost? 
Make sure to like and subscribe if you want to learn more about military drones and click the video you see on screen now to find out exactly how big military drones can get.